Hello, ladies and gentlemen, I am Rarquaza. Welcome to Quaza Contemplates One Way Heroics Plus. This is a, uh, this is a game that was suggested and gifted to me by a, uh, a friend. I actually don't know which friend it was, so if you were the friend that gifted this to me, then I appreciate it. But someone suggested this and gave me a copy on, uh, Playism. You can normally purchase, you can either purchase the base game, which is One Way Heroics, which is fully functional and still really good, apparently. I haven't actually played it, I'm, this is a blind playthrough, but uh, you can you can purchase it on Steam, uh, One Way Heroics, that's like $7, or you can go to playism.com and get uh, the not DRM free, just download, which is what I have here, um, with, uh, Playism, or One Way Heroics Plus for uh, $8. So. That out of the way, I've never seen. I've never played this before. I've ne I haven't seen any play of it. I watched like a video of like the hook on, of on Steam, I think. Um, but oh yeah, okay, wait. Uh, I have it written down over here. N uh, Narazad. I don't know if that was the name that they used in other things, but um, on Playism, they their their username is Narazad. So thank you so much to that person. I actually don't know who that is. I can't connect. That's why I forgot it because I can't connect that username. Anyway. That aside, um, we are going to start a new adventure here. I looked in the options menu, there's lots of stuff. I don't know what any of this stuff means. So, we're going to exit settings and start a new adventure. Start the adventure, choose name. Uh, go like, uh, oh, when I press shift, nothing has been completed yet. That's my gold list. Nameless, uh, so we're gonna be Quaza. Okay. Welcome to the world of One Way Heroics. At this screen, you can customize your character's appearance and stats. Once you're ready to set out on your adventure, you can change these settings at any time you start. Every time you start. So feel free to use these default settings when you first start. Choose class. Okay. Type A, male. Okay, so there's the sword master. Your combo hit rate is 30% of other classes. You can use the berserk skill to power up your attacks. You're the ultimate close range fighter. As for your only real weakness, it's that you're not great at identifying pick equipment you've picked up. The knight. You have spent your days in castles fulfilling your duty as a knight. Damage reduction when using shields is twice the normal rate. The great wall skill helps makes this class the ultimate defensive fighter. Starts with good equipment and is recommended for beginners. Okay, we'll play the knight. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so, apparently there's unlocks that you can do. Um, I like the, the female knight sprite, actually. But there's, there's a lot of unlocks in this game, so these are not the only two classes. Um, from what I understand. Uh, okay, so you start out with more life, strength level one, you start a weapon, knight's coat, leather shield. Uh, Alright. Choose perks. Blah, 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 blah. Perks. Strength plus. You didn't skip out on your weight training, so hold on. How many... How many... Survivor. Okay. So strength up. Increase your attack power by 20 over the level zero rating. It also increases your weight limit. So strength is... Uh, Attack power 20 by 20% and weight limit. Agility is combo hit chance by 2 to 4% and make all other actions quicker. Um, vitality is life and life recovered on the hour. Damage grace taken is decreased. Intellect. I item identification rate by 5% each level. This ST needed for skills and energy depletion are both reduced by 2%. ST. Your ability to concentrate is unparalleled. Willpower. Forced power effectiveness increased. I don't even know what the critical hit chance. Uh, okay. Charisma is shot prices are reduced and allies attack power. Okay. Survivor. You have higher life than other people. 25% max life at the start of the game. I don't know how much, if, how effective like these things are. I think we want like strength. We're going to go strength. Um, oh, and you can have like three strength slots if you wanted. Um, I think, but it's I think it's good to have uh, vitality if we're going as a knight who's super tanky, right? Uh, and then maybe we'll go. Um, what was the other one that I thought was nice? Item identification rate, fleet-footed, quick actions, yeah, agility sounds good. Combo hit chance that sounds cool. Um, okay. The goal is defeat a demon lord and unlock a class. Zero out of six. Okay. So we are good. We can... Uh, start, right? How do I start the adventure? Okay, here we go. 
Bam. Create a new random world. Manly input the dimension. I have no clue. Uh, heroes, uh, dimension... Uh... All the drops in this world is silver! Okay, I think we're just gonna... What the hell? I don't know what these are. These are probably maybe ult online things. We're gonna create a new random world. I think there's online stuff. Walk in the park. Afternoon stroll. Those looking... Okay, walk in the park. <laughs> Demon Lord appears at 400 kilometers, no partners. Weight limits plus 10. Okay, so this is like tutorial dungeon. Advice from the beautiful fortune teller, Aris and Dimension Lugerman. If you even meet your device, then you should be able to carry something over to the next hero. Maybe a new class or a new perk for your characters. One day, a true, soon, a true hero will rise and save this world. Well, that is all the advice I have. Good luck on your journey. Time for the adventure to begin. Press any key. I'm using the Xbox 360 controller, by the way. King Victor, hello, Qua or hero Quaza. I thank you for coming in our time of need. I am king of this land, Victor. As you are already aware, this world is being consumed by an unknown darkness. It has already made its way to the gates of my castle. Please, I beg of you, find a way to defeat the Demon Lord and bring peace to this world. It isn't much, but I've prepared some items to help you in your journey. The, this potted herb is a mystical item which grows a healing herb once every 12 hours. Treat it with care. I know it will be a tough journey, but we leave the destruction of the Demon Lord up to you, Quaza. I will be leaving this castle as well. I hope we are able to meet once more. Now it is time to depart. I pray for your success. Fairy Iris, use the arrow, key, arrow keys to move in front of NPCs and press 1 or enter, so green A for me, to talk with them. Once you're finished chatting, make sure you keep, make sure to keep going to the right arrow key, the right arrow. Time stops when you're not on the move. Okay. Okay, so the gimmick of this game is that it's like turn-based, so think bard mode from Necrodancer. Everything that you do, the, the, the screen only goes to the right. This game is called One Way Heroics. You go to the right. That's the whole gimmick. You only go right. Okay, so we're gonna talk to this guy. You can open treasure chests and boxes using the lock picking skill. All right. Uh, down at the bottom, it looks like we have our the time, the level, our weight, our per coin. If you don't have the lock picking skill, you can still break them open through brute force. You can destroy walls in the same fashion. Okay. Okay, so we can break this chest open and then. Pick up four, 145 silver, a Natalia fruit, and a vial of healing. That's in our inventory. Okay. Talk to this dude. I'm Judge Charisma. It looks like you have a Charisma level of one, so you aren't completely untrustworthy. There are at least a few more people out there who may join your struggle. Okay, so we're gonna uh, talk to this dude. We are already on the brink of destruction. Leave the castle and head over there. The battle with the Demon Lord will be a drawn out fight, but even a pinprick draws blood. Keep at it and the Demon Lord will succumb. We will stay here and share our fate with this castle. Please finish the fight for us. Knights excel at defensive abilities with clever use of healing items. They can stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Demon Lord. They are also the class with the highest survival rate when surrounded by enemies. All right, cool. Uh, you are leaving me behind as well, aren't you? There's no way I can outrun the coming darkness, so I will at least do my part by telling you about upcoming areas. Oh, Jesus. She updated her mini-map with the Elf Village, Small Shop, and Small Town. All right. Well, I guess this is goodbye for me. Do your best to reach the end. Oh. Madam. No. You did a great job getting to this new world. I will teach you all about the stuff you can do here in the plus world. This is the plus world. What's the high speed movement? If you want to go faster, hold down the, f the five key. So I'm assuming the five key while moving. And there's safety measures that can sense nearby enemies to stop before they run them. That being said, the safety measures won't be able to sense enemies inside buildings. So try not to use fast movement recklessly inside the rabbits. Oh god, they they died. They were consumed. You may have already figured it out, but one or enters the attack button. Defeat all that oppose you. If an enemy approaches you diagonally, it's crucial to face diagonally while holding down three so X Okay. X lets me rotate. I got it. Or shift. Okay. Okay, so hold on. I don't know what high speed mode is, but if you need to talk with me, press B or escape to open the menu and look for speak with Iris. Oh, okay. You can use skills and items and change equipment. Okay, great well, wall. Although the skill reduces ST, which I have 15 of, I guess, 130 life, 15 ST, and energy of 93%. I don't know, <laughs> freaking, I don't know. Uh, one use of great wall. 
It reduces ST by one each turn. It reduces physical damage by one third and automatically heals wounds. Any movement cancels the effect. Usable once a day. Okay. Awakening. Your attack power. Stop time for three turns. Your attack power is also increased, and it's not necessary to meditate when using force powers. You're limited to five uses per adventure. Okay. Botted herb. Mysterious botted herb that endlessly grows healing herbs. Once harvested, another will grow back 12 hours later. It's ripe. Let's use that. Potted. Okay, we got the healing herb from the potted herb. Hold on, I gotta go back into my menu. What is this? Uh, N Nayuda fruit. Fruit that revitalizes the body, restores energy by 70%. Okay, so that's like, energy must be like our actual, ST must be sp like special points, like uh, like, ener like energy in like another game, I don't know. So we use that to cast things. But energy must be like, we have to keep our energy up, you know, we're running. All right, uh, herb restores 40% life and restores energy by 10%. Vials of healing restore life by 100. Long sword, 100 centimeters. Uh, very specific. Four, an attack of ten. Defensive. Shield. Good enough to handle low-level beasts. Alright, dropped item. We don't have any dropped items. Options. Alright. So hold on, what's the, uh... Pad seven. I wonder if we can, uh... Acceleration. Pad five. V... So on the keyboard, V and it would just be V. What's pad five? Just the number five on my thing? All right. Dude, I don't even know. I don't. I don't want this. Oh God! <laughs> what have I done? Hold on. Let's. Yes. Reset key bindings. Okay, good. All right. Okay, we've we've looked at our equipment. What is that? It's possible to empty bottles of waters, bodies of water or mountains. If there are enemies around, they get multiple chances to attack. So be careful. Okay. What is this? A lance. I'm gonna pick up that. All right. Someone left their lance on the ground. Leather armor. Quality unknown. Unidentified. What is this? Clothes. All right. What's this? Stamina herb. Nice. Light shield? Okay. Hold on. So, we've picked up all this loot. So, let me let me go into my menu. Okay, these are equipped. Quality unknown. So if we equip that, we still don't know what it is. Okay. So, equipping takes like a turn. I'm assuming. Sword? Okay. Oh, there's an enemy. Alright, so. How do we attack? Imp throws the big stone! Don't throw the big stone, alright? How do we, uh. <laughs> please don't. Okay, now. We're oh, we just destroyed him. My experience is higher. Okay. All right. This is a. Uh, I don't know what this is. This is a dude. Getting ready to swim. This will take five turns and reduce stamina. Did I die? They're throwing big stones at me. Jesus Christ! I received the big stone. I don't want to go in there. Damn. Holy crap. Okay, I'm re I'm recovering health. So we'll take 10 turns and reduce stamina by a large amount. All right. Vial of flame. When oil that burns when exposed to air, when thrown at an enemy, it'll be set on fire and take force damage plus 25. Keep away from open flames. Weight limit exceeded. You will not be able to re move until you reduce your weight. All right. Uh, so we, we need to drop some stuff. Let's drop this lance. Maybe. Attack 21 plus? Attack is... Attack of the sword. Wait for attack 10. Okay, so we don't actually know. Let me let me drop this leather armor, actually. Or these clothes. Who needs clothes? How do I drop? Uh, three and one. So, these ones. There we go. Alright. No. I don't want to register any equipment there. 
I'm, I'm assuming eventually we'll figure out what's going on. Scroll of confusion. All right, bat. Key. Oh, get wrecked. Strength increased by one. All right, leveled up. Potted herb is fully grown. It has been an entire day. Use healing herb. Okay, hold on. Let's go in here. We'll pick, pluck the vial. Use that. Oh yeah. Oh, there's a fish in there. Oh my god. It's a nasty fish. Fanged fish. I don't want to swim necessarily. All right. Freaking goblin. Intellect. All right. Cool. Oh, there's a bigger fish. Got some big stones. Oh, Jesus. This is a big fish. Man. Level four. All right. This reminds me of another game that I played um, on Steam called 10 Second Hero or something. 30 Second Hero. I don't know. 90% experience. Level five. Max life increased. Awesome. I don't think we can... Can we get in here? Yeah, nice. Okay, so there's loot all over the place. Parchment of Healing. Ooh, a book that restores healing force power. Restores force power times 10 life to a person in front of you. Of course, it won't work on enemies. Weight limit exceeded. Okay. Uh, we're not going to read that. Let's drop... Stone which can be thrown at enemies for damage. Okay. So hold on. Let's drop this leather armor then. I actually don't know... How heavy is this? Weight of three. Yeah, so... We'll drop that. I don't actually know how to, uh... Oh, whoops. That was an accident. Uh, let's put healing herb on three. There we go. Don't actually know how to identify these things. Oh, shit. What am I doing anymore? I don't even remember. Okay. Alright. Agility increased by one. All right, let's kill this fish. Oh, there's a lot of enemies. There's two goblins over there. Is that what that is? Can I di move diagonally? I can. It's just harder. He's super swole. Level 8, weight limit increased. Level 9, weight limit increased. Oh man, that guy was super fancy. A hundred, one thousand. But a traveler, huh? I'm a member of the Jade Forest Group. My duty is to track down criminals who hunt endangered animals. Be careful not to kill any foxes, otters, horses, rabbits, or goats. Basically anything fluffy. All right. Otherwise you'll come kill me forever. Potted herb is fully grown. All right. I'm down with that. More healing items, because why not? I need more energy. Can potted herb restore? Oh, this can restore my energy by 70%. I'll wait till I'm below 30% energy then. Oh, shit. What's this? Vitality increased. Lure seismic slash, a powerful attack that deals high damage to enemies on all sides. God. My charisma went up. Oh, dude, there's chests in here. That chest! Okay, we're not gonna be able to break that chest and get out alive. Holy shit. Okay. Uh, let's eat this Nayuda fruit, because we're tired. Alright, so that's like just like taking a nap. A nap. I'm gonna break into this house and kill all these dogs. These are fluffy, though. I have a bad feeling. Okay, we've leveled up. Leveled up a bunch. A million silver. Oh, Jesus. Iron chest containing herb. It has a million. What? It healed. Oh, man. Okay, I need to get the fuck out of here. Wait, wait, wait. Let me out this door. <laughs> Let me out. It's not a door. It's just a just a room. Why do I have a bad feeling? Enemies! Oh, jeez. The 
bat is keying at me. Alright. Ooh, there's a unicorn. That is a white horse. Ancient white horse. Oh my god. Get the fuck out. How do we... Oh my god. It restores 40 life. Jesus. Jesus. Hold on. Scroll confuses. All characters next to the player can be very useful and surrounded, or you will still get beaten to a pulp. Um, Vial of Flame. Oh, Jesus. Restores life by 100. Use! Okay, we're gonna use the Scroll of Confusion. Ancient White Horse is confused! Fuck it up! Fuck it up! Where are you going, horse? No! The horse is gone! I had to do that. We're gonna have to get the fuck out of here. Oh, they're blocked by the chest. That's so good. Okay, fuck you, chest. Don't throw a big stone at me, please. Holy shit. Okay. Uh. Holy damn. Alright. I guess we're gonna, like, kill this dude. I actually don't. <laughs> okay, we're level 17. Okay, there's stuff. digging this so far like this is something that I could get used to to trying to trying to learn and trying to play this is so definitely something that I could play like either on stream or YouTube honestly chipped jewel all right level 18 all right nice what is this thing up here what is all this oh shit this is hell itself Archman of Healing. Reach a new area and gain some experience. Alright. At Havax Volcano. Alright. Sword! I wonder how you identify items. I, there, I'm sure that there's a lot of stuff that I'm, you know, mechanics that I'm missing out on. That's something that you can only learn with, with time, right? Okay, now it's dark. Is it night? must be night. Oh, my herb is ready. You know what? I forgot that. Gotta pick, pl pluck that herb. Oh, wait. Ow. Ten damage. Oh, critical hit. Healing herb has been shattered. Reach the 100 kilometer marker. Okay. Oh, Jesus, let me out. 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 This is kind of spooky. Okay, what's this? An owl? A harpy. All right. Throws the big stone. If you know what I mean. The demon lord is on his way here right now. The demon lord should arrive around the 400 kilometer mark. Make sure you're prepared for battle by then. All right. That is a... What is that? is a bear. Ow. Max life. This is a harpy. It's dead. Some loot. Scorching, scorched bud. Hunter's bow. A bow handmade by hunters. Range plus one. Has higher accuracy than military grade bows, but suffers in damage output. Okay, weight limit exceeded. Alright, so let's, let's go through here. You know what? We have too many swords. Let's equip this sword. Fuck the other sword. Going YOLO on that sword. Uh, this hunter's bow. We have fl 10 flaming arrows, so we can actually use the hunter's bow like at some point if we need to. Scroll of Armoring. Armor strengthening spell created in ancient times and endows all equipped armor with a flexible effect, which raises the damage thing. I think we should just like use that. And then that was good. The scorched bud plant burned to a crisp. Oh yeah, let's. let's 
the jokes though. We have lots of big stones, if you know what I mean. Seismic Slash. This attack uses Shockwave doing abnormally large amount of damage. It will cause confusion in enemies occasionally. Oh, look at this Scorched Bud over here. Stimulant Herb. Oh, man. The herbs, though. So tired, need food. Alright, we're running out of energy. Let's use a... Stamina herb. And also... Heals states such as confusion and temptation. Oh, man. Okay, what's this over here? One who seeks force power. I'm an Aria of the Sun. I can teach you benevolent force power. Which force power do you want to learn? You only learn one at a time, but learning it will cost you some of your intellect. You can learn two types. Detection. You see the position of your enemies and allies. 200 silvers and intellect minus one. X-ray vision. Can see through the darkness of buildings. Oh, man. Rain healing. Path of nature. Makes the three tiles ahead passable. That's really good. Man, that does sound excellent. I'm gonna do x-ray vision. Alright, so we just like learned tactics. Oh, this guy's a super rock thrower. Oh. I'm glad we're over to the right side of the screen. Uh, yeah. Alright. Wow! Three levels. Alright. Four levels. Quasi learned defense. For five turns, damage taken will be redu reduced to one third. However, your attack power is also reduced. We need we crystal of the ancients. Beautiful crystal said to dwell within the bodies can be sold for a high price. All right. Stimulant herb. We need to uh, like. We need to take a nap. Do we have any sort of? How do we get healing or energy stuff? Don't know. Oh. Dark Nayuda fruit. Cover 30% of your energy, but it also cause food poisoning. Those who love Nayuda fruit will gladly eat it. Okay, we're gonna eat that. It's food poisoning, that's fine, I think. <laughs> Probably not, honestly, but we need the energy, I think. Let's get this. Scroll of Jerry rigging. Fully repair the durability of equipped items and armor. In exchange, items will break easier. Okay, I don't care. Pretty much. Food poisoning level 1 for 139 turns. Okay, we got a harpy. Chipped jewel, I believe we can sell that. Uh... Oh, max life and ST reduced to 90%. Alright. Generating world. It's now day five. We've been awake for five days, journeying across. What is this? Alright, I don't even know what that was. The fanged fish inside the, the land. We have to go around this stuff. Reduce stamina. Let's just get out of there. Oh, Sword! Broken to pieces. Okay. Uh, looks like we're going to switch to... This is the durability on the right, I think. This lance. Okay, now it's daytime. So lance gives us ooh combo hit, nice. Okay, sword will pick up that. Weight limit exceeded. Uh, what's our weight at? 47 out of 41, so we need to just drop these big stones. Oh, whoops. I'm overweight. <laughs> oh, no. Can't move. Um, so 
has one weight. What has weight here? Parchment of Healing does have weight. Um, let's eat this. Do these scorched buds. There we go. Now we're at the perfect weight. Wooden arrows. I'm assuming they have zero weight because. And this lance, though. Pretty good. There's some silver. I have a bad feeling. I'm gonna eat this. Eating all this fruit that's on the ground. Okay. We're back in the forest. Hero, can you hear me? I am the goddess of time, Kronos. If you wish, I can use my power to record your progress. I spent five levels to save current level 28. No thanks. Understood. May your journey be blessed with good fortune. There's a thing over here. Reach a new area, gain some experience. Zephyr Prairie. Okay. Because we're in the forest, maybe we have a uh, pack rat, feral dog. Axe, healing herb. Let's uh, get rid of um, this long sword. So we have more swords, even though we don't know what they do. Wait, what's this thing up here? Wait, I thought my... I'm the dark chef. I'll fill the bellies of trash like you in exchange for money. Super healthy meal. <laughs> uh... Energy and life plus 999. Temporary strength increase. What's our money at? Yeah, we'll do it. All right, then experience the awesome flavor of the super healthy meal. I dig it. <laughs> what? Power is swelling throughout my body. This food is amazing. Hmm. If you like it so much, save up your money till next we meet. Thank you, Dark Chef. Just try to hurt one of the villagers. We'll make sure you regret it. Otherwise, you consider us good friends. Please rest and relax. There's only one villager. Medicine. Do you need any medicine? Healing. Vial of dragon flame. Flammable dragon oil. Dang. So, force damage plus 25 with the regular flame, and then the dragon flame is force damage times 2 plus 40. I see. Let's buy these healing vials and these stamina vials, uh, and then we'll... Oop. Complete transaction. Please come again. All right. I'm overweight, I can't move. We need to drop these wooden arrows. If equipped, you can throw this when other attacks can't reach your target. Of course, it'd be more powerful to have a bow equipped with too. Uh, okay. Arrows are no weight. Let's throw this sword, because we'll use arrows if, if we run out of uh, lance. Tentacle weed. Craigasm. When this herb hits, hits something, it'll immediately sprout roots at their feet, stopping their movement. This root will wilt away in for about five turns. Okay. Force arrows. It's nighttime. It's this thing. Oh. There are two bats behind me. Oh, there we go. What is this thing? I don't have the lockpicking skill. I broke the wall behind it. Dimensional gold coins times one. What? <laughs> All right. That's cool. Okay, it's daytime. I'm suffering from food poisoning. Or no longer, maybe. 146 silver. Let's go in this house. 
Oh, Jesus. Weight limit increased. Am I poisoned or something? I am cursed for nine turns. I'll receive damage. Minus one life every turn. Okay. Dude, that is a crazy bat. Quaz's curse has expired. Alright. Max energy increased. I wonder if we can like, break through this wall. Not in time. Okay. Hey, hero, can you hear me? The demon lord is halfway here. Make your preparations for the final battle. We're doing that. That's like halfway through the game, though, so... Ow. Charisma. The land's broken to pieces. Okay, hold on. Let's equip a new weapon. And these uh, wooden arrows. Oh, yeah. Get wrecked. Arrows are OP. Tentacle weed. We can throw the tentacle weeds at the demon lord and just chain stun him with arrows. I would love to, like, have a not arrow weapon so that we can save the, uh, Nayuta fruit. I'd love to save the, uh, arrow and bow for. I have a feeling something good is going to happen. Okay, you had a bad feeling earlier, and that didn't do anything. Eagle eye beast. How many arrows do we have? So tired, need food. We're at 30%. So I'm not sure if it's all blown in for somewhere else, but this area seems like it, there's a lot of stuff on the ground. The amount of items you pick up temporarily increases. You should stock up here. Okay. So let's drop. No. The bow I need to save. Oh, the bow's fine. Never mind. We're out of arrows. No, we have 11 arrows left. Okay, we'll keep that then. So as long as they don't run out of arrows, we're fine, I think. There's a potion. Nice. Stamina herb. Very nice. Let's actually use one of those right now. I need to harvest my goddamn healing herbs. Man. Eight healing herbs. That's pretty good. Dimensional gold coins. Gold coins with a value beyond time and space. You can sell them, but if you die or complete the game while having them on you, they probably go to your next run. That's pretty cool, actually. I like that. Okay, now you do fruit. So tasty. Delicious. Oh, there's a sword. Yeah. Nice. Now we have a backup weapon. Let's actually switch to that right now. Oh, Lance. Okay, hold on. So the sword we can drop and we'll equip this lance. I like the lance, man. We're wanting to pick up items, right? What is that? Scorpion bee. That's pretty cool. Healing herb. Overweight. <laughs> you gain meditate plus one for ten turns. Your critical hit goes up by twenty percent and accuracy increases by ten. Okay, we want to save some of these things for. Uh, okay, save these things and we we'll buff up right before the demon lord, right? Why are all these feral dogs pissed? Old Graz Volcano. A slender spear. Effective reach of two tiles. Very thin spear. Not very durable. Okay, well, we'll just do that there. How, mu how much durability do I have left on this, uh, this lance? I don't know. Combo hit. Potted herb is fully grown. 
Okay, I'm actually full on stuff. So I'm not gonna do that. I'm having a lot of fun with this game. I'm not sure, like, I'm sure well, I can learn a lot. And there's a lot of stuff that I'm missing out on, but... Longsword. Scorched Bud. We'll just eat that right here. I have a really bad feeling. Okay. Strong enemies! Oh man, the music freaking changed. All right, let's do a, uh, pop a, uh, crap, I don't know. Let's use a, Yeah, we'll use Awakening. Continuous action is now possible. Nice. Get wrecked. Clothes. It's an armor. Oh, there's a bear. All right. These aren't strong enemies at all. How's our armor looking? Read. Bonus effective tough was applied to your armor. All right. Flexible knight's coat. Get some more durability. Nice. Let's check in here. Trying, okay. Scroll of confusion. Hello, would you like to record your progress? Do you have something else in mind? Buy save crystals. No. Goodbye, traveler. Welcome, what can I get for you? Healthy meal, hearty meal, bread crusts, free, nice. I'll take that. Well, that's what you want, then consider it on the house. Delicious. Oh, well, I, sh <laughs> well, I sure will start make making some bread crusts then. Don't forget, we have takeout lunches as well, not like you could afford it. Next town is for quite a ways. Best to watch your durability, youngin. Thanks for the help, or the, the advice. Generating world. Sword. How's my lance doing? Let's uh, let's drop this, and we'll pick up this sword, and then we'll equip the sword, just because I want to refresh my durability before the final battle. Scorched bud. Scroll of analysis. Oh, that's cool. Okay. What are these geo dudes doing? Oh my god. This sword, like, explodes. Light shield. Oh my god. Alright, let's drop this. We'll pick up this. And we'll use this scroll of anal- wait, hold on. Pick up Elzite Bomb. Area map. Teleport pill. Dangerous medicine called fly can be not be used on golems, bones, chests, or doors. Cannot be put in a sealed place. Oh, shit. Where the fuck am I? Okay, I'm up here. Hold on, so let's use this, uh, this, uh, what is it? Scroll of analysis. Said to hold the unimaginable stores of information. It unveils details of all unclassified items in your possession. Okay, so the later that we use that, the better. There's a super dude over there. this stuff. Quality whetstone. Oh, 
But our hero has no weapon. Wait, am I just punching? I am just punching. I didn't ever pick up that... That... Oh my god. Okay, we need a weapon. I'm gonna eat this Nayuda fruit. I should have picked it up and traded it for something that wasn't as good. Okay, we need a sword. Oh, this is spooky. I don't like this at all. I'm not going to spend turns doing this. I need to get the fuck out of here. I'm, I'm bailing. There's too many dudes. Oh my god. I can't bail. Oh my god. I need to bail. Holy shit. Holy shit. Um... Within the 3x3 tile of where the bomb hits does 80 plus force power. Taking fire damage causes it to misfire and explode 60% of the time. Fuck everything. Oh, Jesus. 3 healing herb has been burned. I died! Oh my god. Burned alive. Cause of death. Something caught me off guard. Something is too strong. Uh, Even though I made it all the way to that, is it really impossible with my trusty bare-fisted? <laughs> My beloved knight, knight's coat plus two can, can't defend us against that. This world is screwed up. Screw this world. I'm going to another one. It should be so easy. If only I hadn't been so stingy with my silvers. I won't lose next time. Hurrah! Time for another run. I'll be ready next time. Man, that's... Ah, I've had enough courage. Curse you. That's enough for today. Let's meet again. Um... <laughs> is it really impossible with my trusty bare-fisted? You are engulfed in a column of flame. You try to your best to squelch the flames, but they show no sign of subsiding. The hungry flames consume all of the oxygen in the air, and every breath scalds your lungs and organs. As your consciousness flees, you are finally freed from your agony. Hmm, you even got pretty far this time. What a shame. All right, well, settle down and get ready for advice time. <laughs> oh my god, this game is, like, pretty freaking good. I'm digging this a lot. On the next screen, you can expand your dimensional vault for the ability to carry items over to your next playthrough. Early on, it doesn't even cost many points to expand it. Even just adding one weapon or item at a time can make the ad next adventure go a lot smoother. Give it a try. Thanks, Fairy Iris. Well, that should be enough for today. We'll just keep on the adventuring when you can. See you soon. S. Level S. Level 42. Consumption 0. Distance B. Battle grade S. Value of assets, double S. Oh shit. Heroics level 109.8, A plus, pro knight. On easy mode. Start the game with only three bonus perks. No dimensional vault gain, no dimensional vault withdrawals. Overall heroics level plus 10%. 10% of the treasure chests acquired. Uh, defeated 57% of enemies without taking any damage. Wow. Did not murder any friendly characters. Earned a heroics level 50 plus with a knight class. Defeated at least one enemy with a bow. Hunter's bow was revealed to be Hunter's bow plus one. Light shield was revealed to be a leather shield. Nice. I don't know what all this means. In this game, you have received dimensional gold coins, a total of one. This way they were placed in the dimensional vault. Never gold coins is one. Hero points total has increased by 109. What are our hero points? A new record for the knight class has been added. Overall heroics level. Title, first class knight. You can now choose avatar type C special for the knight class. First time hunting, you can choose the hunter class. This class excels at range attacks and scouting. Advice corner, use hero points. Post to Twitter. Replay data. See a screenshot when, when killed. Nice. Uh, post to Twitter. Oh, that's interesting. Use hero points. Spend hero points to expand on your next playthrough. You currently have this many. Unlock, expand your dimensional vault. Unlock a new perk. What was this thing? Hold on. No dimensional vault withdrawals. You get a journey of the unprivilege. Okay. Unlock a new perk. Swim coach. 
Master of Unlocking. Swing level plus one. Master of Unlocking. Lockpicking level plus one. Increase barefisted damage. I dig it. Gain a pet partner. That's pretty cool. I think I'll hold off, though. So unlock a new class. Pirate. Discover the Dark Brotherhood. Open an adventure. Open an extravag extravagant chest. Force user. Defeat an enemy using force powers. Oh, my God. Bard. All right. I'm not going to do anything. Thank you guys for watching. Dimensional Vault. It's a vault for carrying items over to your next playthrough. Only five platinum, or five points. We're gonna we're gonna return to the last screen. I'm assuming that I can use those later. Um, so we can we can choose like the sea. Ooh, look at that! You get like a knight helmet now. Hunter. All right. It's pretty sweet. Anyway, I dig it. I'm having fun with this game. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, hit the like button and subscribe. Um, thank you once again to uh, Neherazad for picking up this game for me. Uh, this is definitely something that I could play on stream or on YouTube. I don't know. If you guys are interested, I, I would not be adverse to actually trying, uh, trying out this game a few more times um, on YouTube. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Hit the like button, subscribe if you have not already. Thanks for watching, guys. Take it easy. Bye-bye.